Dio Y'all ready to get started? Um Some people from an outside perspective might say that y'all had a perfect relationship. You know, you had adventure, thrill, excitement. And now we're here. Uh, last week, you all said that uh, you met at the beach. Um, and Dior, you said that there was an instant connection, correct? Um, and you all said that uh, you were in a polyamorous relationship with one other person in particular. Where are they? Gone. Gone. How? She left. Honestly, I can't blame her. What the hell does that mean? Last time I checked, you didn't really care that she left. Right. Okay. I'd like for us all to take a deep breath real quick. Thank you. Um. Claude, I would like you to tell me what happened. <laughs> so, what did she say? At first she was open to it. But then she started talking about how it felt weird being with her man and her best friend. Nearly 10 months in and she says something now. Yeah. How do you feel about it? I don't know. Well, I know you must be bummed out, but I'm still here with you. I think it's a good idea for us to keep seeing each other. I don't see why not. That ain't gonna mess up your friendship. Look, I can't speak for her. She made her choice and stuck with it. She never asked me how I felt about it, so I'm gonna make my own. Besides, I doubt there's still much of a friendship between me and her. She made her decision and I made mine. What's yours? Dior, how long was your friendship with Treasure? Three years. Okay, and Claude, how long was the relationship with Treasure before Dior joined? Two years. Dior, it seemed uh, that it didn't bother you when Treasure left the relationship. Why is that? Friend or not, people will make decisions that are best made for them. I simply don't question it. She had her own true reasons and plus, I had to hear about it from him. She never came and addressed me correctly. Uh, hypothetically, uh, let's say she did tell you about how she felt. What would you have done? Would you have left the relationship? Yes. Well, maybe. Only if Claude wanted the same thing. 
Hum. So how did that make you feel, Claude? Why did you stay? She made a decision. We had an agreement that if anything was wrong in a relationship, we would all talk about it. She chose to leave. Okay. I have a, um, another question for you, Claude. Do you love Dior? As many times as I don't been here, the view never fails to amaze me. It's beautiful. Yeah. Mississippi has its beautiful part. Yeah, but I still don't want to stay here forever. I love you. After um, Treasure left the relationship, did y'all continue being polyamorous or did you become monogamous? Hi, I'm Ashley. I'm LaShawn. Brianna with three N's. Okay, um, what do you like to do for fun? Well, I do crochet and I used to be a stripper. I like to box. I can box with anyone. Girls, gays, theys, thems, anybody can get it. Um, my grandma taught it to me. It really helps me decompress and relax. Club doesn't really see me that much anymore. It's just, um, about Monday through Saturday. Um, yeah. All right, well... We're looking for someone to join a polyamorous relationship. Would you be interested? It all started when I was in middle school. I was bullied the whole fucking time, so I started throwing hands to any bitch and non-binary that did me the fuck wrong. I got you. Okay, LaShawn, we will get in touch. Um, I never tried it before, but I'm interested. Really? Okay, great. Wait. Do y'all be, like, making y'all bed and humping in it? You mean sex? Yeah. Yes, we do. Is that a problem? Well, it's just... I'm a virgin. I'm down for anything, but, like, okay, like, don't be super, like, controlling, um, or, like, mean, or, like, foot fetishes. I don't rock with those. Um, no. Right. Let's go. How long did that last? Not long. I don't know how we thought that was a good idea, but damn, was it fun. <laughs> Doctor, these past two years have been the best years of my life. I, we, we were happy. But... But she became obsessed with this thrill. You were too. You're right. To a certain extent. Everything started to go left when you started hanging with Jayla. Um... Who's Jayla? My best friend. <laughs> That's what you want to call her. <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me, Damien? You're so full of shit. <laughs> you know what? You and Tiana can both kiss my ass. We're done. I'm sorry. Um, <laughs> I was not expecting this motherfucker to play with me like this. Oh, it's, it's fine. Uh, mind if I join you? Sure. Thanks. So, what brings you out here at this hour? Oh, just sitting, thinking. Life? Yeah. Yeah. 
Um, you know, I've never seen you here before. How long have you been living here? Oh, uh, not too long. I moved here in September, but I had to relocate because of the mold. Oh. I'm in 305 now. You're kidding. I'm in 304. Really? Yeah. I didn't think anybody lived there. It always seemed so, you know, vacant. Right. Uh, I moved in like three months ago. Plus, I kind of work later in the day, so, yeah. Damn, that's crazy. Mm -hmm. Um, you know what? Instead of just sitting here and being depressed, <laughs> um, I feel like we should go get drinks tomorrow. My treat. I could really use some company. I'm down. Uh, that's great. Um, oh, Dior. I'm Jayla. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Girl, tonight was so fun. Thank you so much. I really needed it. Because, girl, Claude has been... He's really been stressing me out. No, I, seriously. I, I could tell. <laughs> I could literally tell. Ugh. Girl. Yeah. So what are you going to do about it? I don't know. I don't know what it is. We just... We have not been here. Mm -hmm. We have not been good in a long time. You know what? I'm going to be honest with you. That was the same shit that me and Damien went through. Yeah. Like, I just had to say bye to that nigga. Like, literally, bye-bye. You're done. So, I don't know. So, what do you think? I don't know. And if I want to be completely honest and give you the best advice, I really think you should let it go. Yeah? Yeah. For your own peace, that's all I can say. She would let her drag you out to all of these wild events and parties. You're just jealous that I was having a fun time with my best friend, all right? And maybe you should make some instead of being a bitter old asshole. Well, maybe you should be better at picking some friends. What, this is your fifth best friend? Oh, uh, This year? <laughs> you know what I think? What? I think you're just some scared little girl. Deep down inside. Trying to fill the void, treasure left. Crazy thing is, you the one that made that hole. You know what else? Everything really was upside down the night of my birthday. <laughs> I feel so good right now. It's me too. <laughs> oh, what do you want to do now? We could do any motherfucking thing. Um, oh, there's a place up there, up ahead, that can let us two bad bitches in for free. Oh, bet. Let's go. Let's go to that. <laughs> but no, I was just, I was just telling her the other day because it's crazy how like she get. Ooh, what do you think you're doing? Oh, Jayla, this is Claude. It's his birthday. Oh, happy birthday. <laughs> been looking all around for you all night. Oh, I'm sorry, baby. I've just been having fun with my friend. And I think we should get with her. I'll call her over. Jayla, Jayla, this is Claude. Oh, hey, nice to finally meet you, handsome. <laughs> I'm taking you home right now. I'll come home with you anytime. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Why? We're just having fun. Yeah, you can come join us if you want. Sure, let's go now. No. You can come and stay with us and have fun. I mean, Yo, can you shut your ass up for a minute? Claude, what the fuck is your problem? Jayla, are you okay? Yeah, um, it's just no fun. <laughs> Leave us the hell alone or I'ma call the cops. Come on, girl, you okay?
Can I ask you a question? Sure. I want you to be honest with me. I will. Do you really think I've been trying to fill a void that was left by treasure? Where is this coming from again? You said it during our therapy session. Yeah, like six months ago. I thought we were moving past that. I tried, but it's been bothering me, so can you please just answer? Yes. All of the friends you were making, they all had treasure-like qualities. Of course, you would think that. What is that supposed to mean? You are so damn judgmental of every person I've hung out with. You always say they have treasure-like qualities, but Jayla was different. You didn't even give her a chance. Like, she was the worst of them all. How? She had you in the middle of the street, drunk. Every weekend. We were just having fun. Having fun? That's not fun, Dior. It's dangerous. Two black women, drunk out of their mind, on the street, looking to be taken advantage of. But we're still here, aren't we? <sighs> when is it gonna stop, Dior? When are you going to stop chasing this lifestyle? I'm tired of it. I want to settle down. I want to build something meaningful. I want a wife. I want kids. Clark. I don't know what kind of life treasure promised you, but I can assure you it is not what I want for my life. For the first time, I feel free. I can come and go as I please, and I'm not gonna let anyone, yes, including you, take that away from me. I think it's best if we go our separate ways. Goodbye, Claude. Right. I never liked Jayla. But it wasn't because she had treasure qualities. It was because sooner or later you were gonna become just like her. And I knew when that moment came, I would lose you. And I had. Hey girl, it's me, um, you want to get a drink? Okay, cool, um, I'll meet you in 15 minutes.